Kong in the trunk. I'm back. Road Rants on Star Wars. If you like this video, like and subscribe. Join the Road Squadron. I got two bits of news today. Pretty quick video on this. Uh, we will start with Lando, a Star Wars story. <laughs> this is from StarWarsUnity.net. This guy, Jeremy Conrad, again. A small update on the future of Solo and Disney+. Plus. You might be remember back in September, we posted a rumor that there was some sort of spinoff or continuation of Solo, a Star Wars story, in the planning stages. Now I found out more detail from a separate source that backs up what I heard in September. When the story was originally posted, it was clear it wasn't clear exactly what form the sequel spinoff would take. And while I still think it's likely the series will deal with the crime syndicates such as Crimson Dawn and Black Sun, Disney and Lucasfilm are apparently very serious about trying to bring Lando back. And there's more. During the Disney uh, earnings call, it was hinted that future characters that show up in The Mandalorian could spin off in their own series. It sounds like that I idea isn't limited to that show. If they are able to bring Lando back in a solo spinoff, it's very likely he'll also receive his own series on the streaming service. And Bob Iger did, of course, talk about the future of Star Wars was going to be by way of series uh, on, on Disney+. Plus. Look, I actually enjoyed Solo, but I got to tell you, of all the things they played up that everybody played up, especially the media and the people that supposedly loved the movie, didn't enjoy it, loved it, was Lando. I thought Donald Glover, Glover was overrated. Hashtag overrated. I did. Um, I thought Alden Ehrenreich was better as Han, frankly. Um, and I thought every time that Alden was on screen, he blew Donald Glover right off of it. Um Woody Harrelson blew D Donald Glover right off the screen as Beckett. Now, do I think this could happen? Yeah, I think it's going to happen. I really do. And I'm not sure anybody wants it. Um, now, the caveat to that is I don't know how it's going to happen because I do think there's a Crimson Dawn Darth Maul series coming. I think that is... I've heard from several different places that was happening and it could be a game game warfare style series between Darth Maul and the Huts. that I'd like to see frankly okay let's bring on game warfare Darth Maul versus Jabba the Hutt and all the bounty hunters good god yeah I'll, I'll, I'll watch that I will watch that my gut feeling would be Lando will show up in that show and they, then they will spin Lando off. But why not bring Han and Chewie back? So, I don't know. Now, the other tidbit is from Kessel Run Transmissions Podcast. It is about Star Wars Rebels 2. The sequel is coming this year. Um, it's multiple sources said the sequel is on for this year. The show will star Ahsoka and Sabine. Dave Filoni is back on board. It releases November 2020. It will, of course, be on Disney+. Plus. No word on Ezra and Thrawn yet, although I've seen some detailed leaks about it, and I think I made a video on it. It's back in my playlist somewhere. About the animation, the only thing I heard was the animation was tighter. Not entirely sure if that means it's closer to Clone Wars or just completely new animated style. I'd like to see something slightly closer to Clone Wars, frankly. Flank, frankly. Uh, the official announcement, we could hear something officially soon, but probably after Season 7 of Clone Wars. Another scoop we got is that Hasbro is preparing to pump out Clone Wars merchandise. Okay, so I guess we got Clone Wars figures coming pretty soon. So that's, that's kind of cool. Um, I might have to pick, pick a couple of figures up. From, from Clone Wars. That might be good stuff. 
Um, I do want to see a sequel to Rebels, by the way. I liked Rebels. Um, Rebels was a show that started out pretty rough, but the last two seasons was really good. Not, not Clone Wars good, but, you know, the first couple of seasons of Clone Wars wasn't great. And, um, so Rebels kind of started out the same way. And then the, especially the last season of Rebels was, was really good. That world between worlds and all that. You tell me what you think about Rebels 2 and about Lando Pando, a Star Wars story coming to Disney Plus. Peace. I'm out till next time. King Kong in the truck.